A very pleasant good morning ladies and gentlemen welcome once again to the people's forum of in the streets with big stone when i saw the prime minister of barbados prime minister mia matley and the president of barbados dame sandra mason make that move to make barbados a republic and to do away with the queen a sense of pride, a sense of dignity struck my heart. It is a powerful move and I must say congratulations to the people of Barbados. Congratulations for such a great leader as the Prime Minister Mia Matley and also the President of Barbados Dame Sandra Mason. Congratulations. Rihanna you have made your country proud. You have done the work that it is the status of a national hero. And I think personally, you deserve every bit of it. Congratulations, Your Excellency, Rihanna. I just want the Jamaican people to take a look at this video provided by Loop and see the, the smile and the words that comes out of Rihanna's mouth as she accept the status of national hero. Please take a look. Good, uh, good morning. This is a day that I would never ever forget. It's also a day that I never saw coming. Is the accent the people man the people y'all are the true heroes of Barbados and I take y'all with me wherever I go I'm so proud to be a Bajan I'm gonna be a Bajan till the day I die this is still the only place I've ever called home I love Barbados I love you guys and I pray that the youth continue to push Barbados forward me in this way I have Nothing, nothing compares to being recognized in the soil that you grew in. So I thank you so much for this. Thank you. she must have felt proud because she said she travels with Barbados her country wherever she goes that is how I feel about my own country Jamaica it has been said oftentimes by some of our leaders that they will move from the status of the Queen to our own status as an independent country a Republic that has yet to be done. It is also in the Jamaican atmosphere that Bob Marley should be made a national hero because of the work that he has done. I agree 100%. Also, Chief Taki of the Maroon should be made a national hero as well. Let's go to the Loop newspaper and see what is happening. While social media user continued to laud Barbados for striking out on its own as a republic by removing the Queen as head of state, the views are mixed in relation to the Caribbean island nation naming pop star Rihanna as its next national hero. Across social media too, the news of the singer being named Barbados 11th national hero has reignited the discussion about Bob Marley being a national hero in Jamaica. The announcement of Rihanna's latest achievement was made by Barbadian Prime Minister Mia Amor Motley at the installation ceremony of Dame Sandra Mason, President of Barbados, and the declaration of the country as a republic. 
and as soon as it became public early Tuesday, social media was abuzz with discussion on whether Rihanna becoming a national hero was an appropriate decision. Reacting to the Loop's new story on Rihanna's national era status, Facebook user Cranston Kelly described the Barbadian Prime Minister as a leader who was elected to lead, and she is leading. While we in Jamaica struggling to name Bob Marley's national era because he used to smoke ganja, now rich people in Jamaica have license to sell and deal in ganja. I can't tell the last time I hear any news coming out of Parliament or anyone who occupies a seat there that give the nation pride and joy, argued Kelly. We have to be looking to little Barbados to cling to some hope and tell ourselves that at least one leader in Mayor Matley is demonstrated how to put country first, he added. But Facebook user Skin Sparta Jake and Ruley disagree with his suggestion that Bob Marley should be named a national hero in Jamaica. Cranston Kelly, garbage. Since you at it, why you don't give Kodja, Taki, Usain Bolt, Veronica Campbell Brown, Dennis Brown or Jimmy Cliff so you would end up with over 100 heroes? What's the sense? The man argued. On the Bob Marley era debate, social media user Natty Dalios called for people to calm down, suggesting that naming Bob Marley a national hero would be a demotion to the gang. Marley is, is already internationally recognized as a hero. Calm down people, he added. I made that debate, the discussion of Rihanna, latest recognition, rage on. Paul Bogle, Nanny of the Maroons and many other real living heroes fighting for justice, equity and the scourge of exploitation in the Caribbean rolling their eyes right now, shake my head, wrote Janoy Malcolm, a Facebook user. Another individual, Tijan Morrison, responded, Janoy Malcolm goes to show that people don't have a clue how much she Rihanna has done for her country including building school and hospitals and training center and has multiple charity for sick and needy in Barbados. Dolores Brown a point, this is one time when I don't agree with Barbados. It is a shame. They love their people, but not that way, man. Natalie Ferguson agreed with Brown's opinion, adding, I'm not sure how a pop star earns such an accolade to be called a national hero. National heroes are those who give their life for the pursuit of justice and equality. I'm impressed with her charity work, yes, but national hero is a stretch, she suggested. However, on Twitter, the commentaries were more in favor of being bestowed the honor of national hero. Love this. Rihanna's come such a far away and grown for our eyes. I love it so much. Tweeted M-Z-R-E-V-Z, -E you know. Ladies and gentlemen, as the comments pours in and as people agree and disagree, the status of a national era doesn't necessarily mean you have to give your life, but you have to give your love and your service and your life, whether you are alive or dead, for country. And I think Rihanna has uphold the banner of Barbados. She carries this beautiful little country in her heart. She have done the impossible. I applaud you, Rihanna. I love you. I love the work that you've done. And you're still here on earth to do more work for your country. You don't have to be dead to be a national hero. You just have to have love of country, love of self, and love of dignity for your people with respect. Thank you all for watching. Let me hear your opinion in the comment section below. Let me hear how you feel about this. Should Rihanna be named a national hero? Let me hear from you. Please like, share, and of course, subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for listening. Have a